U.S. President Barack Obama has made a rare Oval Office address after the San Bernardino shootings that left 14 dead. He said the killings were an act of terrorism designed to kill innocent people. But freedom is more powerful than fear, said President Obama, warning that falling prey to divisiveness in American society would play into the hands of extremists. He also said the U.S. must make it harder for potential attackers to obtain guns. Mr. Obama vowed that the U.S. would overcome the evolving threat of terrorism, but warned that Americans cannot turn against one another by letting this fight be defined as a war between America and Islam. If we're to succeed in defeating terrorism, we must enlist Muslim communities as some of our strongest allies, rather than push them away through suspicion and hate, Mr. Obama said. He reminded his audience that Muslim Americans were part of U.S. society. And, yes, there are men and women in uniform who are willing to die in defense of our country. We have to remember that, he said. The president warned that turning against America's Muslim communities would be exactly what Islamist extremists in the so-called Islamic State group want. Mr. Obama told Americans that terrorism had entered a new phase, from large-scale attacks by al-Qaeda to less complicated attacks by radicalized individuals.